Okay, second of the addition reactions is hydrogenation. Uh, in this reaction, the double bond is broken open and it reacts with a hydrogen molecule, turning the alkene into an alkane. So if we take uh, propene as an example, then at the end of the reaction, what we have is propane. This reaction requires high temperatures and pressures. So let's use the hydrogen that we're reacting it with. Uh, requires high temperatures and pressures and a catalyst in order for it to proceed at a useful rate. The catalyst is usually a transition metal such as uh, nickel or platinum or palladium. Uh, so the way we write this, uh, in the last slide I was writing the uh, halogen above the arrow rather than in the reaction as a reactant. This is a convention that I'll talk about um, a little bit later on. But So hydrogen is one of our reactants and we also need to use a catalyst, so I'll just put platinum there. So consider in halogenation um, we had to break apart, for instance, a bromine molecule and that required only 193 kilojoules per mole whereas to break apart a hydrogen molecule in this reaction requires 436 kilojoules per mole so this reaction requires a lot more energy to proceed a common use of uh, the hydrogenation reaction is the manufacture of margarine margarine is made from vegetable oils but these tend to have multiple double bonds and also relatively low melting points and it turns out that by using the hydrogenation reaction to remove some of those double bonds, you can raise the melting points of the oils, meaning that they are a soft solid at room temperature and therefore more useful for spreading on bread.